As we gaze upon the starry skies brimming with billions and billions of stars, we can't help but feel a sense of wonder and awe. The vast expanse of space holds so much mystery and unpredictability, with forces such as gravity and physics operating differently from what we know on our humble planet. The possibilities of what lies beyond our grasp are simply mind-boggling. But what we see up there are not just stars, but also thousands of satellites revolving around our planet. And one old satellite, long thought to be dead, has recently led to a discovery that has sent shockwaves through the scientific community. The anomalies in space are often intertwined with the presence of extraterrestrial life, but the reality is often rooted in the mysteries of science yet to be discovered. Today, we will delve into this science phenomenon that has left our scientists astounded, the zombie satellite. Are you ready for a spine-chilling space tale? Hold on to your seats, because we're about to enter the world of zombie satellites. If you are new to this channel, and if this video gives you any value at all, please click the like and subscribe buttons because that would really help us out to go ahead and pump out new videos for you guys. Have you ever heard about zombie satellites? It may sound like something out of a sci-fi movie, but it is a real phenomenon happening right above our heads. Satellites are an essential tool that we use for a variety of purposes, from communication and navigation to providing real-time information about Earth's weather patterns and environmental changes. Did you know that currently there are more than 6,500 satellites orbiting our planet and nearly half of them are no longer operational? Unlike a controlled re-entry that causes the satellite to burn up, some satellites remain floating in space as eerie pieces of junk orbiting our planet. It's like a space graveyard, and it's not just spooky, it's also a serious concern for astronomers. Imagining rediscovering these abandoned, broken satellites and bringing them to life. They're called zombie satellites for a good reason. Who knows what secrets they hold? Get ready to uncover the mystery of these undead space wanderers. Get ready for an exhilarating tale of one man's quest to uncover the secrets of the sky. Meet Scott Tilly, a zombie satellite hunter extraordinaire, who's made a name for himself by helping NASA re-establishing contact with their lost satellites. But that's not all. Tilly's search for old functioning satellites led him to a remarkable discovery that could change the course of space history forever. After successfully locating the nuclear-powered U.S. Navy navigation satellite named Transit 5B-5 from the 1960s, Tilly set his sight on a more challenging feat. He aimed to uncover the LES-5 satellite, launched back in 1967, making it the oldest functioning geostationary satellite ever recorded. With all his skills as a zombie satellite hunter, Tilly dedicated all his time to finding this elusive satellite. After several attempts, Tilly finally caught the radio measurements for LES-5, and his excitement grew as he began studying the satellite's data. But what he discovered was nothing short of disturbing. What secrets was LES-5 holding, and how could they change our understanding of space exploration? Keep watching as we're about to go on a discovery to uncover the thrilling secrets of LES-5. This is a story that's sure to leave you on the edge of your seat. Now, get ready for a trip back in time to the 1960s, where a group of military planners was on a mission to revolutionize the way we communicate. Meet the Lincoln Experimental Satellites, or LES, which were part of a groundbreaking experiment to determine the viability of satellite-based military communications. In the midst of a nuclear war, the loss of communication could lead to massive destruction. That's why military planners needed a solution, and they turned to satellite relays to keep military units connected. The LES satellites were born, with their primary function being military communication. But the LES satellites were more than just military hardware. They were also pioneers in high-tech communication. These satellites were built inside the Lincoln Laboratory with cutting-edge technology that allowed an operator to type a message, view it on a screen, verify it, and transmit it. Imagine receiving text messages and online notifications in the blink of an eye. Back in the 1960s, this was an extraordinary feat, and the LES satellites were at the forefront of this technology. 
But the real milestone came when the team confirmed that the satellite could be accurately used for communications. It was a breakthrough moment that paved the way for modern-day satellite communication. LES-5 was part of this range of satellites. The military used this satellite to test a wide range of antenna designs and they conducted air-to-air -air communications between aircraft, including B-52 bombers. LES-5 was tested all around the world, from Southeast Asia, where a lot of importance was given, that the Vietnam War was ramping up, to Panama, where operations were conducted to test the accuracy in heavy foliage and adverse weather conditions. LES-5 successfully cleared all of these tests. At the end of the day, it was LES-5 that proved to be the stepping stone towards the possibility of a new type of communication that could help the Americans win any war. After years of experiments, the satellite was downgraded and made available for university research, while the military moved on to the larger, more advanced LES-6 satellite. But that's not the end of the story. The LES-5 had a battery on board that was supposed to turn off the satellite after five years. But it just wouldn't die. For almost four decades, the LES-5 satellite was believed to be nothing more than a piece of space junk orbiting our planet. But in 2020, our zombie satellite hunter Tilly was keeping an eye out on the skies and discovered something absolutely amazing. Inspired by another satellite hunter who successfully discovered LES-1 in 2016, Tilly was close on his mission to finding the elusive LES-5. According to Tilly's blog, finding this satellite was like looking for a needle in a haystack. It was that difficult to track down. But on March 24, 2020, Tilly finally made the mind-blowing announcement that he had successfully located the signal for the LES-5 satellite at 237 megahertz. But wait, there's more! Upon rediscovering this old satellite, Tilly realized something absolutely incredible. The LES-5 satellite was still working after all these years. Its radio signals and communication system were still perfectly functioning. Despite being downgraded for university research, the battery that was supposed to turn off the satellite in 1972 had failed, and the LES-5 has been orbiting Earth all this time, operating on the power of its solar panels and quietly transmitting data for over 50 years. This means that after all those decades, the once thought dead satellite can now be communicated with and can be used. But here's the catch. The creator of LES-5 at Lincoln Laboratory has not given any comments about the sudden discovery of their lost satellite, raising speculation with the public. One crucial thing that you need to know about this satellite is that the LES-5 was used for classified military projects, as the laboratory was known to have worked with the US military. Imagine finding a lost military satellite that's been orbiting the Earth for over 50 years, still sending data at 100 bits per second. The real question we have is, what secrets does it hold? Would it be possible to hack into its computer system and uncover classified information? It's like a scene straight out of a Mission Impossible movie. However, cracking into the satellite system won't be easy. According to Tilly, it would take a tremendous amount of effort to decode the data, we would need the help of the original creators at the Lincoln Laboratory. But even after repeated requests, they refused to give any statement that would help uncover the hidden secrets of this lost military zombie satellite.